Hello everyone this is Anuj from Gadget Geek Recently in India Ministry of Information Technology has banned 59 apps stating privacy concerns and the government of India has disallowed the usage of such apps in the country with immediate effect Talking about the apps which are banned here is the complete list of the apps and these apps are banned on both iOS and Android platform And guys if you're using any of these apps on your phone then I request you to immediately delete these apps right now Now in our today's video we are going to show you the best alternative apps of some of the commonly used apps from the list. We will not be covering each and every app here as some of the apps in the list are not useful to us. So starting the list the first app is the cam scanner. So the alternate app for the cam scanner which I recommend is the Adobe Scan. This app is really easy to use and you have similar features as cam scanner. And you need to click a picture here. and in the app you can scan a whiteboard form document and also a business card once you save the pdf file it will be uploaded to the cloud and will be synced with your account and from here you can share the pdf file as the link or attachment in the email overall adobe scan is an easy app to use and my first choice now after the ban of cam scanner Next app which is banned now is the UCam makeup app and for this app we recommend the alternate B612 beauty and camera app apart from that there are several beauty apps available on Play Store which you can try in this app you get the real time beauty effect preview which includes face shape skin tone etc the filters are really easy to use and from this app you can take photos as well as shoot videos with the beauty filters There are also AR stickers in the app such as animal faces, makeup effects and so on which are very well optimized. Overall if you're looking for a beauty makeup app then B612 is one of the best app to use right now. Next app we are going to talk about is TikTok. TikTok is also one of the app which got banned and there are a lot of apps which are available similar to TikTok but of course with better privacy. There are a couple of apps which you can download and use. First is the Bolo India which is an Indian alternate to TikTok. Like TikTok, you can create short videos in the app and share it. You can download and share videos as per your interest in across different categories such as GK, health, English learning etc. One more alternate to TikTok is Mitro which is in the news recently. This app also offers similar short videos and you get same swipe up to quickly see the videos from different users. This app also offers similar short videos and you get swipe up to quickly see the videos from different users. And functionality wise, both these apps are very close to TikTok but are made in India. There is also a new app these days which is Chingari which offers similar TikTok like experience. So if you're looking for best TikTok alternative, then do check out these apps. UC browser is among one of the app which got banned and you have lot of options when it comes to the browsers on your phone. The first alternate is Google Chrome which I'm sure most of you know it already and I personally use Google Chrome on all my devices and it's very fast and really easy to use as well. In other browsers you can use Microsoft Edge, Mozilla Firefox and Opera. All these browsers are available cross platform which makes them useful as you'll have your bookmarks on all your devices and most importantly you will not get malicious ads and push notifications like UC browser. which i don't know why came pre-installed in some of the budget segment phones and to be honest i'm really happy that this app is banned in india next app which got banned is the parallel space now this is the app which allows you to use two versions of the same app on your phone for example using two or more facebook whatsapp account on your phone there are quite a few alternate available to this on play store but the one i have used myself and i find it good is the dual apps dual apps offer you a parallel space where you can install one more copy of the apps like whatsapp instagram telegram and other social media apps on your phone apart from that you can add any other apps from here this way you can use two whatsapp numbers on your same phone and functionality wise this app works really good so if you're looking for an alternate app to parallel space then this is the app you should check out next app which is banned is the share it Share it used to be the most commonly used app when it comes to sharing files and media but now as it's banned the best alternate we can recommend you is the Google Files Go. Files Go is really good and easy to use for both browsing and managing your files and data on your phone. Apart from that, this app also offers share feature where you can send and receive files easily, which is very similar to the Share It. 
The connection process is fairly simple and the app is really easy to use. So for browsing and sharing files, we think Files Go is the best app to download on your phone. Now before we proceed to our next app, out of the 59 apps, there are a lot of cleaner and booster apps which to be honest is pretty useless and we never recommend them to use on your phone. As nowadays, your phone is well capable of managing RAM itself and you don't need any app to boost performance of your phone. So if you're using any app like this, then uninstall it right now. Apart from that, if you're looking for a cleaner app, then Files Go also gives you an option to go through the junk files and remove them manually. Now moving towards our next app and it's the DU Screen Recorder. So if you are using DU Screen Recorder on your phone, then the best alternate we can recommend you is the Screen Recorder. The app is easy to use, just press the record button, select the settings such as mic, resolution, frame rate etc. And that's it, you can easily record your phone screen without any watermark or advertisement. You can also enable your front camera while recording videos. Overall Screen Recorder is the best alternate app we recommend over the DU Screen Recorder. Next banned app is the Mi Video Call app. And the alternate app which we recommend is none other than Google's own app Duo. I've been using Duo for quite a long time for video calling and I find the video quality really good. You can do video calling with multiple people at the same time. Apart from Google Duo, you can also use apps like WhatsApp which is also a very good app for video calling. And then we have Skype. Skype also offers meeting option which allows you to set up chat or video call meeting. And the last banned app in our list is the WeChat. And now for this, there are plenty of alternate available such as WhatsApp, Skype, Telegram etc. And you have same and in some cases even better features available. Telegram is my favorite among them which I personally use myself more over the other communication apps. So that's it guys, these were some of the best alternate apps we can recommend to you over the apps which got banned recently. Let us know if you like the apps which we have showcased in this video. And also, do tell us your favorite alternate apps in the comment section below. So that's all for now. If you like this video, then please press the like button and subscribe to our channel Gadget Geek for more videos like this. Once again, this is Anuj signing off and I'll see you in the next one.